Good morning, friends. This is Victor Alpha 3 Bravo del Yankee. Today's video is about how I made my 1 to 1 Balan transformer. The 1 to 1 Balan transformer. The purpose of this transformer is to act as a choke, preventing common mode current from flowing back to the transceiver and causing problems. Using a ferrite toroid core FT240 Type 43, you will need to cut 4 pieces of 18 gauge magnet wire 81 cm each. It requires 2 windings, the primary and secondary. Each winding has 12 turns around the ferrite core. This is why it's called a 1 to 1 transformer. It has 50 ohms on both sides. It is not a step down nor a step up transformer. This is how I test my 1 to 1 balan. First is the Nano VNA. It was set to sweep from 1 MHz to 30 MHz. The Nano VNA is connected to a test lead with SMA connectors. I use a PL259 to SMA adapter to connect it to an SO239 bulkhead connector. An RG58 coaxial cable is soldered to the SO239 then to the 1 to 1 unbalanced primary. A 50 ohm resistor is soldered to the balanced secondary. This will represent our balanced antenna. A 1 to 1 balan is an isolation transformer also known as common mode current choke. On the next slide, you will see the nano VNA test results on a bigger screen. This is the test result of my 1 to 1 balan transformer using a nano VNA. The nano VNA was programmed to sweep from 1 MHz to 30 MHz. The blue line was the SWR and as you can see, it was almost a flat line. The SWR at 1 MHz was 1.01 and at 30 MHz it was 1.08. I think the result was very good. The next step is to mount it in a plastic housing. It is time to place the 1 to 1 balan into a case. For this, I used waterproof box 11 by 11 by 6 centimeters and I ordered this box from Amazon. I used a special drill bit to make the hole for the SO239 and for the transformer mount, I cut 6.5 cm square of plastic cutting board. I marked and drilled the appropriate holes for the cable ties and mounting screws. I soldered the ends of the uh, transformer to the SO239 connectors. I'm going to use this with my 49 to 1 an -an transformer and to interconnect these two boxes, I'm using a PL259 male to PL259 male connector to save me making and using patch cords. Here is the 1 to 1 balan installed with the 49 to 1 an -an for my 20 meter and fed half wave antenna DIY project. This is how I determined the length of the magnet wire needed to make 12 turns on this ferrite toroid. I use a spare wire, make 12 turns plus about 3 inches extra for the leads.
and then unwind the flex wire and measure its length using a tape measure. In this case, the required length was 81 centimeters. I do this to avoid waste. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. It helps this channel. And your likes and subscription motivates me to post more videos in the future. This is Victor Alpha 3 Bravo Hotel Yankee 73.